grip mind. All right, so. Alright, what's the next mission? Let's go. Oh shit. Wait, let me come back. What? M wait, what's the mission parameters? I'll be spending most of my time in mid-range combat, so... And long-range combat, so the Shiva is good for this mission coming up. Oh, shit, I should have made myself something to eat. Take a quick break. Oh well. We're on a roll here, so let's just keep going. Tendrix. His diagnostics are showing some irregularities. It could be a minor calibration issue, but I don't want to ignore it. Especially in light of his recent outbursts. You know what I'm talking about. That's why you didn't tell him about the tracker he slipped Selim. We're about to launch an assault alongside the Egyptian army. How do we make sure his head stays straight? I can adjust his meds remotely, which should help level him out. But we can't let him compromise our chance to grab Taylor. It won't come to that, Kane. I'll make sure of it. Aw, oh, man. I'm gonna have to kill Hendrix. I'm gonna have to kill him. Egyptian allies are in position. They have the building surrounded. Waiting for our go. Shit. Kane! We just lost the doctor's vitals. What the hell does that mean? It means he's dead. Or about to be dead. Khalil, have your men hold position. We're coming in for landing. We'll sweep the embassy. Await all all clear. What the fuck? Hold on! Manticore operating with a human pilot! Looks like Sarah Hall in the cockpit! You got a fix on Taylor or Moretti? Where are they heading? Negative. Then the only way to Taylor is through Hall. We can't afford to lose him again. I'm using the car as a Paul's on the move. Manticore operating at 70%. Manticore? We gotta get through her to get to Taylor. Focus fire. Oh shit. Damn it! She just done fucking crushed me.
Why is he trying to stop me? I'm not no freaking cockroach. On your feet. She's down. She's down. Hurry, you have to interface before we lose her. Come here. Please don't. So this is what we do now? Kill her own because they blew open a conspiracy in her own backyard. You don't know what this will do. I know. And I'm sorry. Creepy. This just got this has got a next level weird. I just couldn't believe how your perspective, your limited perspective, should influence my decisions regarding the project's mission. Of course, this program has been an unmitigated success. You should take pride in that. Please listen to what I'm saying. The exchange of information is a two-way street. If you remove humans from the diagnostic loop, there is no way to predict or control or influence. We're standing on the verge of Paul? What did you do to me? I tried to interface with your DNI. Something went wrong. Can you hear me? This can't be. Kane, can you hear me? Are you seeing this? Say something. Please. What the fuck is going on? It's the Black Project. That day. It's right before the whole place blew up. Right before 300,000 people died. This is where I was born. A brief moment of agony. Then, darkness. Who is that voice? started here. The gas. Their experiments let a chemical agent escape into the atmosphere. Sarah? That voice, do you recognize it? Oh, what the fuck? I remember, but it's almost like it was a dream. Like it was happening to someone else. How the fuck is Tell she still alive? You remember. The CIA sent us in to investigate an alarm triggered underneath the old coalescence facility. We figured the immortals had been tipped off. Check the room. Clear. Fucking human test subjects. Great. 
This is in breach of every WA ethics mandate in the book. That's all I fucking need. Hall, oh, call it in. Let's go immortal hunting. We all knew that we had just stumbled onto a CIA black program that had been buried for a decade. A program that in all probability had led directly to the Singapore disaster. We called it in, and we were ordered back to the black station for debriefing. You know the routine. Secure the area, I'm gonna pull all sensitive information from their servers. Go. Oh! Uh. Taylor, you okay? Yeah. Getting some glitches in my optics. Okay. Let me help you recalibrate. Sarah? What Can you the... hear me? I know what this is. This is Bastogne. Wait, this is World of War? I studied it at the Academy. I cited it in my final paper as one of the greatest examples of courage and bravery in military history. One of those battles that show you what you're really made of, who you really are. I used to dream about it. Follow me. Show you. Ready to move. Congratulations, Private. You drew the shortest straw of all. Welcome to Bastogne. Now get your ass to the front line. How is this possible? We're on the battlefield of World War II. Fucking World at War! Dayark! No! This has to be an illusion. It has to be. We got Germans, it is! You're even playing the music from World at War! What the fuck? My mind is blown! Fast gun. Freaking got the music from World at War playing.